Hello guys, you're welcome back to my channel. My name is Fola Kemiatos. I vlog about faith, food, healthy relationship and travels. So this is going to be a very short one. Recently, one of my friends invited me to a wedding. Simple, classy wedding. I'm telling you, it's one of the most simplest wedding I've ever attended and she said it's just going to be 10 of us in the wedding it was a beautiful wedding of course they have children together but they just want to solemnize their wedding in the chapel so follow me and enjoy the wedding together yeah, this is us in the hotel room with the ladies making up the bride. Yes, we just we're just making up the bride to get dressed before we set out. Before I go on, if you know you're watching my movie uh, my video and you have not subscribed, what are you waiting for? Don't forget to click the subscription and hit the notification bell thank you don't forget to share my post too yeah we are done with the making of the bride now and we are heading up to the car waiting for us trust women we are always late so right now the car is waiting for us and it's been of course, the bride is already in the car. So we're just waiting so all of us will go together. Because the girls were supposed to go together to the wedding venue. And you know, we are already running behind schedule. So right now, we are panting and running. The place is a very big place. We're just trying to get to the car waiting for us. Because if we miss the wedding, <laughs> it's not going to be funny. So we are rushing to get to the car from here. Yeah, like I told you, this is a very classy wedding. This wedding reminds me of so many weddings I've attended back home in Nigeria, including mine. <laughs> so many preparations, so many things together, so many money to spend. So the bride and the groom, they will be overstressed and everything. So many things. But honestly, I learned a lot of things during this wedding. That wedding can actually be very simple. You don't need to gather everybody in the whole world. The most important thing is that both of you should be happy. That is why marriage is being instituted. For the two of you to be happy and to, you know, to live together happily ever after. So, this is a very simple wedding. Like I told you, there was no much variation. The bride and the groom, they were just chilling somewhere. And, you know, there was not so much for us. Just for us to take care of the bride. The bride just want to look simple as much as possible. And all this wedding is less than an hour. Both the wedding and the reception. So, just follow me. Now we are outside. We are trying to get to the car. The car is waiting for us somewhere. We're trying to wait for, we're trying to get to the car. You know, women, we are always late. So we are running and panting, but we were able to meet up with the time. We're able to meet up with the time. The, the bride is already waiting inside the car. And they're just waiting for us to get inside the car. So... We are almost at the car right now. We are almost getting inside the car right now. At a point we left something, we have to quickly rush back. But right now, we just <laughs> go to the car. We made it. Well, we made it anyway. 
and we are about to enter the car right now. That is the car waiting for us. So we're getting inside the limo right now. <laughs> and everybody would always shouting, where have you guys been? So we just enter the limo, the beautiful limo, and we are heading towards the chapel. Everybody say hi. And everybody is saying hi to you, my subscribers. Yes, we are heading towards the chapel right now. Yes, we're just looking at what is happening outside. And that's the bride, <laughs> the Corona bride. <laughs> and Every other person is just doing their things, looking out from the limo. Yeah, we'll soon be at the wedding venue. Before I forget, when, before we get to the wedding venue, they already told us that they will not allow us to take any pictures. They will not just, I think, I don't know whether that's the rule, because like a cult versus ch chapel. So, but they said they are not going to allow us to, I don't know, maybe that's the rule, but... They told us, but trust me, <laughs> I was able to sneak in my phone and took a little clip of the wedding. So, yeah, we're still on our way. The distance from the hotel to the wedding venue is just about maybe 20 minutes or so. But we run into traffic, but we're still able to make it to the wedding in time. Of course, they told us you can't allow to be late or else no more wedding because because of the corona pandemic they're trying to kind of make everything very snappy don't waste time you come take your vow and walk out so we are at the front we're in the front of the chapel right now we are about to just get in and the wedding itself is less than five minutes the vow, taking of the vow, just taking of the vow, and we're out. Yes, so we're just checking in to the chapel. The bride and the groom, they need to sign some papers, then we'll be inside the venue. We'll be inside the chapel. Simple, no, I should be, no. No, anything. It was just, <laughs> to me, I was just smiling. It was. It doesn't really look like a wedding to me. It looks like we're just playing. But it was, it is, it was a wedding. Beautiful wedding. The most important thing, the couples are good. And they're happy with each other. And that is what matters. Yeah, look at that couple. Looking so beautiful. Yeah, the wedding's about to start now. The five minutes wedding. <laughs> yeah, we're in a wedding hall right now. And they're already taking their vow. <laughs> yeah, it looks so good and it looks so beautiful. We had so much fun just within the four or five minutes we spent inside the chapel. Yeah, you can see that's their cameraman. So they don't want any other person to take pictures. So when they finish, they're going to send the pictures to you. But trust me, I hid my camera, my phone, and I was taking the video. So that's why you cannot get the volume or whatever what they are saying. But the most important thing is that they just say, I do. And that was, and that is what matters. So they have been pronounced as husband and wife. Congratulations! <laughs> yeah, the wedding is done right now. So, at a point, I didn't want them to see me with the phone, so I had to hide the camera. I hid it somewhere so that they won't see it. So, but the most important thing is that 
it was a simple wedding very classy wedding very funny wedding <laughs> yeah the bride and the groom were just chilling no stress no force yeah they were just chilling so everything is over now and they are just exchanging their ring. Look at that little man. That's their son. <laughs> that is one of their children. The son. The other lady too. Is their daughter. <laughs> so. If I, the bride is a grandmother. You won't believe it. But she's good. They just want to do the right thing. It doesn't matter when you do it. Just try to do the right thing. Yeah, so. She's putting on that ring right now. And I want to see where they're going to kiss themselves. That's the most important part we all look forward to see. So we want you to kiss. <laughs> the groom is is <laughs> is sweating. That's why that the place is so cold. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> It was such a funny wedding. It was really a funny wedding. But like I said, what that matters is that the groom and the bride, they are so happy with themselves. They've stayed together for a very long time and they just decided, no, we need to do the right thing. Even though we have children, we have grandchildren, we need to solemnize our wedding and they are doing it the right way. Yes, that's what matters. Not all the crowd, not spending all the money in the whole world and you won't even enjoy your wedding. The most important thing is that both of you should be happy together. Now it's time for you to kiss. Ah! <laughs> and that was the end of the wedding. Yes, yeah, the wedding is over. So everybody's going out right now. Oh, congratulations to both of them. <laughs> Yeah, they are outside and we took our pictures. Both inside, yeah, that's inside. Then afterwards, we took those. That, that is all of us that ended the wedding. There are children, about four there. And the others are the friends. Yes, that's all. The wedding's over, including a grandchild that's there. That's the youngest boy there. So after the wedding, some of us took pictures outside. Yes. Yes, then afterwards, we are heading to the reception venue. Yeah, the reception venue is just the 10 of us too. Simple, but beautiful hotel. So the from the hotel where we are uh, from the chapel where we had the wedding to the hotel to the place that the book for us for the reception is about 30 minutes something like that like 30 minutes drive yeah like 30 minutes drive so we are going for the reception right now beautiful day to wait very hot day very very hot day but very bright day So we drove for a long time before we get to the reception venue. Yeah, because it's another part of the city. But it is another beautiful part of the city. Where we had the reception and that's where the groom and the 
the bride and the groom will have in their honeymoon so that's where they book us for the reception so we just got to the reception venue we're gonna pack right now and move inside the to take our menu we've already heard that for whatever we want they just ask everybody to order whatever you want we ordered for it already so as soon as we get there the food is already waiting for us piping heart and we're ready to eat because at right this time we're very very hungry very very hungry so we're famished we're just waiting for us to get to the place and enjoy our meal I'm very hungry right now. <laughs> yes, at this point, I couldn't even hide my hunger. I was so hungry at this point because we didn't even really eat in the morning. We we're just rushing, preparing the bride and everything. But the bride, she took her time. She had before she left the hotel with the arranges. We didn't eat anything and it was already past midday at this point but we are the reception venue right now beautiful place beautiful place so the food is already waiting for us very hot very good food very simple meals we already pre-ordered our food so we know what we're gonna eat So, we're just walking to the dining area while still maintaining the social distance. Yeah, this corona. Oh, thank God. Yes, we're trying to take her order and to take her seat. So, they just have to check you in, make sure that you are the right people that are booked. Then they will show you your seat. So before we were able to get to our seat, we decided to take some pictures again. <laughs> That's the groom taking the picture, looking so. He has really changed. He has removed his suit and everything, and his and the bride to have changed to another thing. But the rest of us were just wearing the same cloth. So. But that's their hotel, that place is their hotel room. So after the wedding, they just moved straight there and they changed before they came down f for the reception. But we, we didn't change anything and we're just enjoying ourselves. Look at all our food. Yeah, from the dessert to the appetizer to the main food. Look at the little man. That's their grandson. Yeah, we had such beautiful meals. Delicious meal. <laughs> Interesting meals. Just what we heard it. Yeah. Yeah, thank you so much for staying standing by me thank you for watching this simple corona wedding see you in my next one bye